his first plenary session after reinstatement. The Speaker, Elvet Ayambem, who was removed on May 22 by 17 members, stressed the need for collaboration among colleagues to improve both the House and the State, highlighting unity as essential for progress. If it were to be a war, I would say there was no victor and there was no vanquish. I'd like to reserve my comment and not speak much on that because it was a negative precedence. But then we have, as an assembly, sat and have looked in what the House came together after a protracted meeting and have, as a matter of urgency, decided that the Speaker of the 10th Assembly should sit as Speaker again. During plenary, Ayambem called for members to move a motion passing vote of confidence on the Speaker. Siri Lomini, member representing Yakawan, moved the motion, while Kingsley Ntui, member representing Itung State constituency, seconded the motion. Speaking to pressmen after the session, the leader of the 10th Assembly, Francis Asukwo, says the move to remove the Speaker was as a result of misunderstandings. Misunderstandings are could come out of lack of information. And then when those people are clarified of those informations and agreements are reached, then of course we move forward. So you don't necessarily need too many people, but definitely our governor had also heard of such and seek or called the house for a meeting to find out what really happened. Of course by then we had already resolved and of course we told them our position. When allegations are made, they are not finality. Investigation needs to be done. And after those allegations were made, they actually drew the attention of everybody to those allegations. And investigations were actually done. And some of the allegations were debunked from the result of the investigation that you know, were carried out. And a few other allegations that border on, um, you know, uh, on conduct. A lot has been spoke, said to the speaker in you know, the need for him to change and see how he can actually work with his members collectively. The Speaker's reigning statement comes after 17 members of the Assembly passed a vote of no confidence against him. The members cited allegations including misappropriation of funds, misconduct during parliamentary sessions, violations of the rule of law, and disrespect toward colleagues. Members of the Assembly have resolved to uphold the decision to reinstate the Speaker in a move aimed at fostering unity and progress. From Calabar, Magdalene Ioma, Arise News.